My name is Mitchell Staben. I'm 16 years old and I ride a Honda CRF 250R. Hey, I'm Brock Shoemaker. I'm 16 years old and I ride a Yamaha 250R. I race against the best like Chad Reed and James Stewart. I'm Kyle Smith. I'm 18 years old and I ride a Suzuki 250 I'm Travis Bright. I'm 19 years old and I ride a Kawasaki 250F. Welcome to Bang & Bars, riders. My name is Clifford Adoptante. I am one of the original innovators of freestyle motocross, medalist in X Games, Gravity Games, and I'm a Vans Triple Crown champion. And I'm Kim Martin. I've grown up in the sport. I love motocross, and racing is my lifestyle. I got my first bike when I was six years old, started racing at 13 years old, and got into arena cross at the age of 17. The four of you have been chosen through a nationwide search for the most talented, undiscovered riders in America. You'll be put to the ultimate test to see if you have what it takes to follow the footsteps of Kerry Hart, Brian Deegan, and Tim Ferry on the Moto Triple X race team. For the next 13 weeks on this 44-acre compound in Piru, California, you'll live, train, and compete like professional riders accompanied with your own personal mechanic. In the weekly skills challenge, one of our guest experts will show you how to execute an important technical maneuver needed to be successful in racing. Your fastest time of the three will be your time to beat. I'm actually gonna be teaching them to go ahead and go through the whoops today. Basically what I'm looking for is, you know, you need to be consistent, be squeezing with your legs. It's all about having patience and whoops and uh, not getting too ahead of yourself so you don't end up on your ass. takes a trip to the pit where your pit mechanic will help you select a part to modify your stock bike or he will remove a modification from one of your competitors bikes your choice next you will compete in several boot camp fitness challenges you'll train in vigorous conditioning programs to achieve and maintain peak physical fitness and endurance which is critical in motocross and the weekly winners will receive gate pick at their next week's race your week concludes with the moto, where you will race against each other in a supercross or motocross style race. The rider with the highest cumulative points total for the season will be awarded a factory riding contract with Moto Triple X Racing Team for the upcoming supercross and motocross season. Brock, Mitchell, Kyle, Travis, if you want the lifestyle of a top racer, then go out there, race, and bang bars. Mitch is probably the weakest one here now. He shouldn't be too much of a big deal. Not worried about any of them, really. Kyle calls Mitch a quitter, and the fact is he hasn't been handed everything on a silver platter. He's actually had to work for it. I've been racing since I was about eight years old. So I'm actually looking forward to it. He's way too cool to be on the show. We're competing to be professional athletes. We're not here to argue like Heidi and Spencer on the hills. Yesterday I signed the Star Girl's butt. I wrote my name and phone number. Still hasn't called though, but I'm waiting for it. When Kyle signed that girl's shorts, he was so dumb he forgot to put the area code, so he ain't getting no call back. <laughs> 
Nationals are always tough because you only get to ride the tracks once a year. You want to train as hard as you can and mentally and physically prepare yourself the best that you possibly can so when you show up, you can beat anyone on the line. Is this sport dangerous? Yeah, I mean, there's definitely big injuries that happen, but this is part of it. They're going to be competing with the best in the world, and if they really want to win it, they're going to have to come with their A game, because this is no joke. I don't need a backup plan. This is what I'm going to do. These guys want a shot at the Moto Triple X race team. These guys got to step up their game, get with the program, and pin it.